The Auburn Tigers were a single play away from snapping a three-game losing streak to the hated rival Alabama Crimson Tide. All that stood in their way, fourth and 31, a down and distance that will forever haunt the Auburn family. Man, it's, it's a lot of hurt in that locker room, and it stinks. Um, our kids gave themselves a chance to win the Iron Bowl tonight, and, and uh, that's going to stick with us for a while. With all the momentum at their backs, Auburn led 24 to 20 with under five minutes to play. Coy Moore called a fair catch on an Alabama punt, and that's when disaster struck. I mean, when he mugged the punt, I was like, dang. But I felt, I felt that our defense was going to stop him. I mean, we just, we did good to the last play. We just had some difficulty. Following an errant Alabama snap, the Crimson Tide faced fourth and goal from the Tigers' 31-yard line. All that stood between Auburn and the biggest win of the year was one final play. And as we've learned in this game, one play can make all the difference. You just got to play with vision. And we got nine guys back there and just play with vision and make a play on the ball and knock it down. The, the main point was, you know, just stay deep, keep it in front of you and back the ball down. We got to knock it down. Or, uh, I don't know. I, thought, I, I couldn't see the corner from where I was out on the sideline, so I didn't know what, who was over there or who they had over there or anything. And it feels like every single time this great game is played in this building, we get an all-time classic. And on the 10-year anniversary of the kick six, well, it was the Crimson Tide who authored their own Iron Bowl moment as 4th and 31 has forever rid its name in Crimson play. But for now, in Jordan-Hare Stadium, I'm Johnny Condon, ABC 3340 Sports.